It was four grueling weeks. You see after that first week and I got rid of that table mm -hmm. with the stuff? Yeah, yeah. Like just walking into my room now, I just feel like... Oh, <laughs> hey guys, welcome back to our channel, Change Makers. It's week four, the last week of the Minimalist Challenge. We made it and I'm going to jump right into it. I found four things around the house took a long time but I have them right so first item last week I went to my closet remember for my handbags this week I took a ton of clothes I have two garbage bags worth of old clothes it looks so bad oh gosh <laughs> um, so these are things that as you can see cannot be worn again or I've not worn it in at least a year so I decided probably will never wear it again right and you know your taste change style change so I really just cleared out my closet it took me a long time but I did it I'm very proud so I have two full bags ready to um, throw out the second item much smaller however <laughs> was this umbrella um, I love this umbrella because it like does that cool oh anyway forget why I love the umbrella I'm getting rid of it I've held on to it and it's it broke like at least six months ago and I don't know why I just had it hanging around so umbrella you're out third item an old suitcase you see the condition I don't think I need to say anything more about why it's going <laughs> and lastly I went into the closet and found a ton of old books. These are mostly, and clearly a broken bucket, um, but these are, <coughs> these are old books from college, you know, a ton of coursework that, you know, I'm not gonna use anymore. Some of them actually I did decide to keep, but for the most part, I threw them up. challenge I was reflective I thought about what worked what didn't work what caused anxiety as I was trying to decide on items what made it difficult and um, I really had to dig deep and I realized that for me and it might be different for you preparation was key so as I started the first week okay I waited till the last minute I picked one lipstick fine for the second week, I got a little bit more prepared. I said, okay, let me look at what I have two of, two jewelry things, okay, that. For week three, I started the process earlier, thought it through, I said, let me pick three different rooms, pick things from there. And then I took it a step further for week four and I said, okay, let me give myself more time. So as I was doing my daily or, you know, day-to-day -day things, I found items there as I did the dishes I found a couple of things as I did laundry I did a couple of things cleaning my kids room found some things went through the medicine cabinet found some things so I focused on those four areas and um, found my items to get rid of from a minimalist challenge right there <music> Hope you decide to do it as well and good luck to you so week four four things to get rid of guys honestly i'm kind of glad that this is over now because <laughs> it got so hard but obviously i found four more things to get rid of so it was necessary first thing i'm so embarrassed that this was even in our house no look on this so dirty broken up uh, it wasn't even holding anything of note like just old screws but it was there in like in our house just taking up unnecessary space so out second item 
which, so you remember that person I was going to get rid of last week? Spencer Rain? He is the reason that the Swiffer looks like this, right? And apparently the part that would connect to make it, you know, have that flexibility, who knows where it is. So there's no coming back for the Swiffer, but we had it, core hoping, you know, Swiffer not too cheap, so you just kind of think, <laughs> praying for a miracle, I don't know, but we'll have to get rid of it, okay? And it's so cute, that pink color, I love the pink. Um, third thing, um, I think a lot of persons have this, just old frames in the house. Um, the glass gone, the back gone, but you have it. And I mean, I'm a DIY girl, so I actually thought of spray painting them and like, you know, putting them up on the wall, if you get what I'm going with, yeah. But I don't have uh, the space for that, so I can't just hope I'm, you know, hope for and just wait for that moment when a space free up on the wall to do it. So definitely getting rid of the back. Um, Sandals frame. So guys, those frames you get when you go on vacation, do not use them in your house. <laughs> so definitely getting rid of this. So, so together, these make my third item, right? Last one. Um, boy, if you live in Jamaica, they sell these just in traffic. So you're probably always buying another one because they <laughs> they um they stop working very fast because clearly they're very cheap. But we have, uh, like, you know, we had this clearly mosquito destroyer, the back gone, it will clearly try to salvage it a couple times, tie down the battery, the battery gone, it stopped working now, but it was in the house still. Fourth item, out. Okay, guys, reflection time. It was four grueling weeks. What made it really difficult for me was the commitment like having to wake up every saturday oh, and yeah, say sure. jamie tiffany we have to do this <laughs> thing the whole world is waiting with bated breath clearly so we have to do this thing so that yes. was difficult um but i will say i'm going to maintain this personally going forward in my life i don't think i ever could be a pure minimalist where they really live like on just 30 items yeah. or 50 yeah. items but I am going to be much more intentional about things that I purchase and things that I keep. Like I'm really going to ask myself, like, why do I have this? What's the real purpose? And make a decision from there. Mm -hmm. I think it's really like lighten my load, um, not just physically, but definitely mentally. Yeah, so of course, same thing in terms of just having to wake up every Saturday and look through the stuff, that was difficult. But I already felt better. You see, after that first week and I got rid of that table mm -hmm. with the stuff. Yeah, yeah. Like, just walking into my room now, I just feel like, ah, <laughs> Like, it's yeah. so, you know, the place just looks so much nicer now and just lighter. So, mm -hmm. I definitely think it already elevated my mood and I go into my room. I yeah, more true. At peace. Mm -hmm. um, so, definitely, of course, going forward, I will... You know, really consider like why well, still have this. I mean, I found that even things we didn't even show on the videos, I was already like throwing out. Yeah. So even things we didn't show you guys were already still yeah, like yeah. lightning just the whole house. We threw out a lot more. We threw out a lot of stuff. Mm -hmm. So yeah, awesome exercise. Encourage you guys to do it if you haven't yep. done it. Definitely do it. Right. Yes. The minimalist game by the minimalist.com. Thanks guys for watching. See you next time. Yeah.